Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to install custom themes and skins on your R4 or R4i card. So the link will be in the description. Basically, you just want to go to it. And here are tons of sort of skins or themes you can get for your R4. So you can pretty much just choose any skin you want. There's a few down here as well. Um, I'm, I'm going to actually get a few. So I'm going to download this Mario one right here. Just click the download button. You can go to more R4 skins. Um, and... I'll get this one here as well. So once you've downloaded um, all the skins you want, you just want to head over to your downloads folder. What you can do from here is just um, extract the files. So you, you can pretty much just select them and then do extract here. Right, so once you've got these skins, you, can, you need to connect your R4's SD card to your PC and then copy them across. So they actually go in the underscore RPG folder and then they go in the folder called UI. So as you can see, I've already got some in here. I'm just going to copy these two across. So now you can just go in the folder. As you can see, here's some skins that actually came with the card. So this is like the basic one. Then we've got this one right here. So that's pretty much it guys, once you've got the skins on the SD card you can disconnect it from your PC and then connect it to your R4 and check that everything works. Right guys, so once you're on your 3DS you can go ahead and launch your R4, just press A on it. So once you're just at the home screen what you want to do is just press start. Then you want to scroll down to settings, then just press A on it. From here, as you can see, it says user fit interface style. So what you can do is you can change it. So right now it's on R4 IDS. So I can't remember what theme I got. I'm going to go ahead and change it to Zelda. So you can just press A to change it. And then just press A again. And press A again. And then the whole card will reboot. And it will reboot into your new theme. So I'm just going to go ahead and change it again, so I can press start again. Then um, scroll down to settings, choose a different theme. Let's go for um, black. Just press A on it. Guys, so that's how you change your themes on your R4 or R4i card. Some themes might not be supported by your card, so if that happens, you can literally just delete it off your SD card and the card will reset its theme. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.